Hello everyone, Charles here. My name is Nick. With today's subscription, we are tasting the difference between black teas. As we saw with green tea before, the reality is different regions have different tastes. And today we are going to put that to the test with our black tea subscription service. So Assam is kind of a blanket name that we give to any black tea blend that is produced in Assam, India. Indian black teas tend to taste a bit more robust, a bit more malty, slightly more bitter than black teas from other parts of the world. It's probably what we're most used to here in the States, and it's very common in English tea culture as well. Kimun, on the other hand, is a black tea produced in China. A lot of times, Chinese black teas have more of a floral note to them. They're a bit more balanced. They're a bit less bitter. It makes them popular in blends, makes them popular with sweets. And today, we're going to see if we can taste the difference. So let's get right into it. They are so identical. So I'm smelling the Kimun and right away I get a very familiar roasted, nutty, black tea aroma. I would say it's slightly floral, but not that much. For the Assam, I'm getting a very woodland, almost cedar smell out of it. Kind of like a freshly cut cedar log, if, if you know what that smells like. <laughs> You know, for some of these things, this is the first time we're even comparing it side by side. Like, you know, I don't think we've ever in, in our life compared Kimun to Assam directly in this detail of a situation. Right. What's great about the kits is you can try these two teas at the same time and compare them in terms of getting your palate trained, increasing your tea knowledge. Tasting multiple teas at the same time, like we're doing right now, is the absolute best way to do that. It's snowing in New Orleans right now. It's, isn't that really weird? God help us all. That's our initial observation. Let's go in for the taste. Cheers. Drinking the Kimun, what? I notice right away is there's almost no bitterness to it at all. It is very smooth, very mellow, floral, slightly smoky flavor cutting through and none of that bitterness astringency that we often associate with black tea. And for this Assam, I'm getting definitely some bitter notes, but in, in a good way with like a little bit of lemon on the back of the tongue. It almost feels and tastes like a broth. You know, when I smell this, I almost get this, like, kind of unani fish kind of characteristic. Interesting. Some kind of, like, undertones of, like, udon. And that's what that's what I'm getting. That's what I'm getting from the Assam. Interesting. Let's go ahead and switch. I've got the Assam. Nick's got the Kimun. Time to go in for the taste. Again, the smell of this is just way more plant-based and very like mossy. That's what I'm getting. The Assam has a little bit more of that maltiness. It is slightly bitter. It's slightly astringent. But in the way that we want black tea to be. It, it, it's not overpowering. You can drink this without milk or sugar and you are set. I do see where you're coming from with that umami, salty, slightly fishy flavor. I'm getting that. I'm getting that unique kind of robust, um, savory flavor palette to it. Whereas when I had the Kimun, it was much more neutral, much more floral, much more smoky. And for this Kimun, I'm definitely getting the smokiness. Uh, definitely getting this like mossy characteristic. And yeah, I, my preference definitely lies in Kimun. All right, guys, if you've been drinking tea along with us, uh, let us know which one you prefer in the comments section below. We'll take a look at those. And if you have any other questions or want to see any more teas in the future and future subscription services, let us know as well. Next month is February, and we will be going into Mardi Gras. And as a local New Orleans business, we are super excited to celebrate the holiday. And I think you'll see something a little special in our subscription service for the month as well. So we're looking forward to sharing that with you. If you want to 
have some specialty teas delivered to your home next month in time for Mardi Gras, go ahead and subscribe to our subscription service now. If you order three months or more in advance, you get one of these really amazing teapots that we use in all of our videos and in our every step of our tea journey from this point going forward. They're the best. Thank you so much for drinking tea with us. And uh, steep on, steeping on. That's right. Have a good one, guys. Peace.